Hey guys, my name is Hugo Valentin Jr. and today we're going to be trying out the new Doritos Hot Mustard flavor. I know it looks a little bit off to me. <laughs> Obviously, here's the regular Doritos next to the Hot Mustard flavor and I'm just excited to try it because I just want to try something new. I'm over here waiting in line, but it's going to be an exciting taste test. All right, y'all, we got the chips. We got the chips. We're ready to try them out. My break is done and now I'm back at my cart, but there's one of my funny coworkers. He's amazing. Shout out to him. <laughs> so while I was waiting for the bus back home after working, the whole sky is just gray and it looked like a really nice movie scene. So I decided to record some clips for y'all and it literally started pouring like i had to go under the bus stop and look at everything flying everywhere it was actually crazy it looked really pretty to be honest i love the rain so i didn't mind but all my hair got wet <laughs> all right so i'm now home and we have this big bag of hot mustard doritos with me and i'm just wondering how it's gonna taste i was really curious i wanted to do a few taste test videos so this is gonna be my first one and it seems to be a little bit exciting there's raindrops because it was actually pouring outside i was running back to my house i literally shielded my whole face with with this hair i shielded my whole face with this hair and it actually worked like i didn't get any rain on my face so but there is some rain in my hair but anyways so here we are with the doritos very excited to see what it tastes like now you know we all know the other doritos we got cool ranch and regular red doritos let's try this one out let's see hot mustard oh my god Okay. Oh. I think um it's like so <sighs> it's really strong. What the hell is that? Oh. First of all, every bite is super overwhelming. Like every time I put my tongue on this, I don't know what's on these chips. And this is the top of the bag. This is the first chip that I just ate. I don't know what this is, but every time I... Oh my God. It tastes like what the hell it tastes like when you're at the hospital <laughs> it tastes like when you're at the hospital or like oh my god i was i was in i was sent into a cat scan before it tastes like what that liquid is you know that liquid they they put into you so they could x-ray you it tastes like that that's what it tastes like because obviously you'll to like smell it Oh my god. Oh. It's like I can't breathe whenever <laughs> whenever I take a bite. How is anyone going to eat this? <laughs> whenever I take a bite, it literally it's like it's overwhelming in the beginning. And it's so funny because usually when you first eat chips, it's like it's overwhelming on the tongue, like everything tingles and then it kind of like settles and it gets used to it. This is literally not getting used to it. It tastes like metal. Like it doesn't taste like mustard. It tastes like metal. It tastes like mustard in the beginning. And then all of a sudden it's just like, it's like, it kind of like pulsates inward. It tastes like I'm getting stabbed. Like, you know, obviously whenever you taste blood, it tastes like iron. It tastes like I'm getting stabbed. Like what the heck? Oh my God. No, I was, 
hoping that it might taste good. Cause I actually, I tried out these green Takis. They're like green zombie Takis. And they were actually really good. The green zombie Takis, they were actually really good to me. A lot of people didn't like it, that the people that they were sampling, like people that were sampling, but I actually like it. Like I actually did like that one. And it was an unpopular opinion. I was expecting it to be nasty, but I didn't judge, judge the book by its cover. So I wound up taste testing it and it wound up being good to me. It doesn't taste bad. It tastes really good actually. You know, those Takis were good. Like they were actually good to me, but I gave this a chance and I legit, it's like, cause I was expecting like, if I didn't like it, I'd be able to just eat the bag and like eat it slowly to get it over with. But like, it actually kind of hurts to eat this. Like it literally hurts to eat this. Like this is not it. I'd like to say no, no denied <sighs> bitch. I, it's like metal. I had to, I had to eat that tiny corner for it, for it to not kill me. Oh, the metal. I'd also like to mention that the metal taste is due to my own personal experience. Nobody that I've given it to has tasted this metal taste that I'm talking about. And I think it's mostly due to the fact that I used to eat so many spicy foods when I was younger. And at some point, my taste buds just became altered permanently. And everything spicy kind of tastes really disgusting. Like it used to taste so good. It used to taste so amazing. That's why I used to eat spicy stuff so much. And it's not that I can't handle the spice. I literally love tearing up and like just getting all watery and my nose running from eating spicy stuff. Legitimately, it just tastes horrible. Like it genuinely tastes horrible whenever I eat something spicy now. And I wish it didn't. So other stuff that I usually eat spicy, like a spicy chicken sandwich from Popeyes, that usually tastes so like bitter, like it tastes so weird. For some reason, it doesn't taste like spicy anymore. It legitimately, like whenever I eat the spicy sauce, it tastes like, like so sour to the point where it's disgusting, like really disgusting. And then when it came to these Doritos, it was just so metallic. Like it felt like I got stabbed. I've been describing to everyone that I tried out with, it tastes like metal, smells like needles, and feels like a COVID-19 test going all the way up into your brain because it feels like I'm getting stabbed every time. <laughs> I need to give other people this. I need to see if any other people will try this. So, you know, I gave it a chance and now I have this family bag of this nasty stuff. This should be the thumbnail. <laughs> But yeah, let me see what other people think about this. Okay, so reporting back after eating a lot of these while just scrolling on Twitter, I actually have become accustomed to the taste and the metal taste is no longer there. So I think it just took a little while, uh, but the metal taste is literally no longer there and I actually love the taste. To be honest though, I'm doing my best to like avoid it hitting my tongue because <laughs> literally that's mostly when the metal taste happens. But even when it does happen, it hasn't even come up anymore. Like I'm just eating it straight up and not even avoiding it. Originally I was avoiding, but not anymore. And it just tastes good to be honest. It just tastes really, like it's not spicy, it's literally hot. Like it's actually hot. It It's like stinging, like it's not, it's not spicy and it doesn't linger. Like it's, it's gone from my mouth, but it literally is like, like when you eat hot food, <laughs> that's the type of taste that it feels like. And yeah. Hey guys. So we're here with two of my friends. I got Chris and Ethan. What's good, this is Rocky. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, they're gonna be trying the hot Doritos and I'm curious of what they taste it. Uh, by the way, it's not even spicy. It's just hot for like two seconds and then it goes away. It burns your- Like literally it goes it away. It burns all your taste like, buds you know, for two seconds. <laughs> I always explain, I explain to people that it's like hot in the sense like of if something came out of the oven just now, not spicy hot. Does that make sense? Oh, so it burns your mouth for a second. 
Ja, so eine Minute. Ich kann auch bei einer Open Air. Genau, bei einer Also, Tom, what time is? It is 3 in the morning. <laughs> okay. Not okay, for you. <laughs> you can't eat these, so you, you'll die. Yeah. No. no, literally, you're gonna have liquid <laughs> shits. <laughs> liquid poo poo. It smells like normal Doritos, like nacho cheese, though. Yeah. It's not good. Because it's basically what it is. No, not a taste test. You go first. I hold this heel. I'm scared. I think I'm gonna hold this heel. I feel like it's gonna be fine, but hopefully it doesn't taste like how I tasted it. Alright, so this is my first time trying this shit. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> no, I, it, it, the kicks are so fast to it. Like, it's burning my, it's not like spicy, but it's like burning my mouth for a second. It's mad fast. Yeah, like, it, it's But then, yeah. then it like, like if you, oh I'd god. say like, don't even drink right away. Yeah, I'm gonna if like, you let yeah. it, it literally goes away for some reason. Like, it's like a kick to like, <laughs> it's not bad. The taste is, Different than what I expect that though is gonna taste. So like. people have said it tastes like uh, I never even tasted it, but apparently it's like it's like Japanese hot mustard. <laughs> it's like um topping. My it's pen. like sauce. Huh? My pen. <laughs> Not as holly. Can you how peanuts are horse horse rack? <laughs> Ew. <laughs> oh he likes it. Don't eat them all now. <laughs> I mean, to be honest, I don't know for me. Actually, let me try one again. So then, if I can see. Let me try one again, too. <laughs> Look. It's fast. Like the, the burning. It's fast. Oh. So now you all taste it. Oh my god. What do y'all. What do y'all both think it tastes like? Horseradish. It's different. It tastes like. Like something my grandmother cooked before. Mm -hmm. It is like a little spice to it, but not like too spice. Yeah. I don't know. It tastes like jalapeno. Yeah. Like yeah. But is it burning anymore? Mm mm. See, that's that's the that's the crazy. <laughs> shit. How do they how do they simulate? I don't like spicy food, but I like this shit. I, it's I, so weird because how did they simulate? How did they simulate the same feeling of like burning your tongue? But not like burning. But yeah, it like at not the same spicy. Time. Yeah. Yeah. Or like, it's not like even hot like cooked. Hot, like, yeah. It, it tastes spicy, but it's not spicy. Think, like, so if odd. you taste this, like, say that you just cooked it in the oven, right? Mm -hmm. And it's like, put it in your mouth for the first time, and it's burning, like, you know, you just took it out of the oven, and it's burning. Yeah. And then, it, like, as soon as that burning subsides a bit. so random. As soon as the burning subsides a bit, it tastes like jalapeno. And I will give it a 5 out of 10. <laughs> Nah. No, for real. Okay. I would give it a 5 out of 10. It's something I won't eat. I'll give it a 10, but they are good. Mm -hmm. 8 out of 10? Yeah. 8 out of 10? 8 out of 10. Um, <laughs> give me another one. I don't know. Oh my God. <laughs> the only reason it's addicting for me is because it's Doritos, but personally, like, did I even rate it? I can't even remember. I think I gave it like a 2 out of 10. Or but <laughs> Still 2 out of 10? Right now, I feel like it might be like a, like a 7 out of 10. <laughs> but, yo, the first time I tasted this shit, I literally, let me tell you, Ethan loves that. The first time I tasted this shit, it tasted like metal. What? Like, it literally tasted like metal. <laughs> it tasted like metal and it smelled like needles. How high were you? I wasn't, I wasn't even high. <laughs> it literally tasted like metal and smelled like needles. And the reason I know how metal tastes like is because when, sometimes when I brush my teeth, I bleed, okay. <laughs> for when I just like opened it. I don't know what it smells like now. It doesn't smell like Doritos at all anymore. Like, smell it now. It smells different. You no, know, sometimes, sometimes when I brush my teeth, I bleed. So, <laughs> you know, I, I know what metal tastes like. But it was insane. And it was like, it was she such a shark. She for a living. No. <laughs> <laughs> I eat all those guys. videos were fake. <laughs> oh, but so, what is it? I. <laughs> the hell was I saying? You said you, you tasted metal. Yeah, I tasted metal and also it literally, like it felt like I was getting stabbed in the mouth. Because it felt like I was getting stabbed in the mouth. It also, it literally, it felt like that same feeling you get when you get your COVID test, but like the sharp one. Oh my God, oh. 
<laughs> that was how my first experience was. I never had that. I had to like to swab up my nose. That was the way I swabbed. I got stabbed in my in my like your in my brain. No, right my here. brain. Right That's, it literally pokes your brain. Yeah. The one that the actual one. Mm -hmm. Cause there's one where you just like rim the outside of your nose no. and then there's one just, that you literally go into your brain which is insane but yeah that's the ratings hope you guys <laughs> like subscribe and comment for more videos like these and i'll see you guys in the next one peace